A hello, a YouTube, and a welcome to another monumental ranked joust solo queue video. Today, we are playing Morgan Le Fay. And we're against a Medusa Opwash. What a peculiar top two. Here are the bands if you guys are interested. We got Ares. Aaron Achilles. And then I banned three Guardians. I just love banning Guardians. It's my favorite thing. I can't even lie. Artigorous. Oh, Alright. We will ban... Something. <laughs> I haven't quite yet figured it out. But I'm gonna get there. What if I just ban, like, E-Set, dude? Like, what about that? People aren't really picking that god, though. You never know. Maybe they are. In this game! <laughs> I'm just banning two mages. I don't think I'm really scared of any of these guardians. So I just banned Baron, because he's just really annoying CC for both of us. And same with E-Set, kind of just like a support mage thing. We got a Neath! Let's freaking get it, baby. Alright, so they banned Marty Osiris. Osiris. Bring back the cam. Atlas is the choice. We have decent matchups into Atlas, so not too worried about him in particular. I can only hazard a guess that that is a tanky opwash, but we'll find out. I think I'm going to go um, Charon's Coin Chronos Pendant. I think that sounds kind of devious here. That's what I'm looking at. I could go book, though. Would make a lot of sense into a double backline, but I don't think this uh, Opwash is going to be a backliner. You know what I'm saying? Need solos? You think so? I think this guy's going crazy. I'm Legion 7. change that <laughs> that's a fake <laughs> is it is it really I will this for sure. wouldn't that be crazy if you just change his name every single game <laughs> <laughs> who is that he's giving yashes all over the world a bad name that's crazy and we're in there <laughs> right, we will be using our abilities over the wall here and picking up the old blue buff I wonder if that off wash is going to go damage or if he's going to go tank very curious Yo, he is spotting some serious enemies over there don't like conduit? I think conduit's good but I just think timeline is a little better Definitely could build Conduit. I mean, it's not troll to build Conduit over Sands. Alright, so what are we looking for here? Clear wave. <laughs> that is the first thing you look to do every time. Looking to clear wave, get farm, and not take poke. Already failed on one of those. I kind of want to go for the purple, but... Not going there alone. As a Morgan the Faith. Very close to level 4. Opwash is going damage. Ability based Medusha. Okay. Just trying to get some clear out. Missing minions. Average from average. I already hate this game. Okay. They used a lot of clear on us there. I'm just gonna boss all my stuff and hope for the best. Oh, easy dubski. Alright, we'll pop both pots here. Maybe I can kill this Atlas. Or maybe this Opwash. Ooh, close. Getting a lot of damage out. Well, Neath has uh, got a Spirit Arrow on the wave, I think. That was her big thing there. 
It would be nice to get a reset here before red. I have a decent amount of time. So I'll just uh, clear this up and get out of here. Enemies behind us. I think she lives that. Unless she jukes weird. We get one health pot for this red buff fight. One step closer to our coin of Caron. There she goes. All right, we can kill this guy. Pretty sure. Magical. Was that good? You guys recognize that? Get a little reset on my ult here. Oh, okay. So, don't think he can kill me. Straight line here. So we can't hit his three over the wall. Only charged my passive there so I could get the cooldown reset on the ult. And now we gotta work on charging it up again. Morgan passive is a relatively complex passive to figure out. Nice. Magical. But the idea is you just need to hit all forms of your abilities on enemy gods. Wait for what, man? What does he want to do? I'm scared. <laughs> Neath and Kumba and Joust, but you're <laughs> Oh, I got, I got rooted. I'll take that. I got my Charon's coin upon my next back, and I think I'm going to buy a Chalice too. I just have a ton of sustain. That's the plan. Be right back. It's going to be huge. Don't really have a reason to sell this other health bot, so I'll just keep it for now. Keep it strapped. You know what I'm saying? In we go! We just shard for fun. Why not? Retreat! <laughs> How helpful. <laughs> well, we suffer a quick death there. But, we do get somebody. Probably not a good uh, all-in from me. I thought my two was up, actually, so... I, yeah, even if it was, I would have died. Kind of bad. That hurt it a little bit. But we're doing just fine. Ults down going into this red buff fight, but so are their ults. Now all three of their ults are down. Spread out a little bit so it doesn't hit all of us. Alright, this guy is low. You're gonna have to leash this. I'm cool, just poking. My two is very good secure. But it's kinda high HP still. <laughs> it's brutal. I'm gonna drop this behind me. Oh. Are you sure that's not Yash? His two is- Oh god! <laughs> Yo, this guy is crazy! He is on it! He is in there like swim freaking wear, bro. Yeah, I couldn't get it low enough before my two could secure, which was a real shame. Battle of the twos. At least we get this rock. <laughs> it ain't all bad. Doing a little clearage. Some tricks up my sleeve. Chrono's pennant almost online, but I don't want to miss this wave. Johnson secured, right? All right. I think I'm going to have to take a little bit of a backseat here. And let my... Oh my god, they're going in. I just used my entire kit on the wave, guys. 
<laughs> Why is that the knee fault that we're taking, you know? That's what I want to know. What's up with that? You know, I think I might just go book this game. Because they're too squishy, dude. I kind of just have to. It's too, too valuable. What the heck? <laughs> what is happening, man? <laughs> what is going on here? <laughs> I th I'm just waiting for the point where, like, Kumba is comfortable walking up to them. Because, like... I don't think I'm going to be doing that anymore. This guy just dashed in. Like, can we hurt him or no? You got ult? You want to use it? <laughs> Ow! Like, man, man. This Kumba ain't helping right now, let me tell you. Oh, that was good CC! He actually did secure that kill, basically. It's kind of just waiting for him to ult, though. A little awkward. What item do we go next? Because usually I would go Soul Reaver. But I don't think I need Soul Reaver at this stage. Definitely don't. And I'm getting hits out onto their carries, so... What if I just rush into the bobble early? I think I'm going to actually go Pendulum is my plan. I could go Soul Gem. Wait, wait, wait. Soul Gem got buffed. Hold up, is that it? Soul Gem? For a little bit of HP and sustain? Is that OP? Never ult the tank. Is that it? Ouch. 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 This off is going to be very annoying, isn't it? Yeah, isn't it? Oh, he's, he's charging the Neathalt. I'm here for it. Oh. Well, that's off Ult. Huh? Ult someone, Goomba! <laughs> oh, oh, he's in there. Nice. Oh my god, this is the best Neath player I've ever seen. Jesus Christ, he's so good. Alright, we're just gonna auto-attack this wave, because I want to have abilities for this guy. I can get a cheeky three on him. He's sidewinding! It's not fair! Get a word on his blue. Did I? Oh, I didn't even word it. Awkward. Is he a blink or something? No. Nice. Got that. The deep ward. I think I'm going to stop taking this blue because it actually does nothing for me. I'm full mana at all times. So I'll just play to try and get this red, I think. We're out of here. I'm coming, team! We just cast him. This using the abilities. Oh, is he saying wait because he has trans? <laughs> Yo, what about the red buff? Neath, there are priorities here. <laughs> She's like, I'll get the back in. No biggie. I got you. <laughs> Dude is an actual fiend, man. Maybe in Smite 2 we can mute voice lines? You think so? Maybe. This off watch 3 is actually really annoying, bro. I've stunned myself off my ult. Once or twice, I think. They just have more things to throw, and it's kind of annoying to me. Because <laughs> I got like two guys that are throwing just things, and we only have one guy, and it's me. And so like when I step up to throw my things, they like throw their things, and then like I just get thinged on, you know? Oh, gee, Williker! <laughs> All right, pop the shard here. All right, 
Some stuff is up. What am I buying? Soul gem, right? Is that what we decided? Did this guy go blank? He did. All right, so I need to be careful. I will definitely go... I can either go blank or I can go Aegis. I think I go Aegis and play to counterplay his engage. Let's try the soul gem build. I'm curious. And I'm going to go Aegis and I'm going to go a potion of power, actually. I think we're at that point. Where it becomes really valuable to have this. Morgan sounds like a donkey. Eh. You've been listening to donkeys lately. Been hearing them. They be neighing or what? The super ultra mega spike. Uh huh. I got a red buff for two seconds. Can I use it? <laughs> Oh my god, that actually did a lot. Yo, this guy might just be OP. Well, I'm gonna get Bobble next. We are about to have a criminal amount of fun. Like, I don't think anyone has ever had. <laughs> ah! I don't think anyone's had as much fun as I'm about to. An impossible amount of fun being had by me here. Alright. Oh, he is out of there. Yep, he knows. He knows I'm a scary man. I'm a monster. We gotta stop giving Kumba the scepter, I think. Because, like, when he gets the scepter, you saw there, the Medusa actually got mezzed for a long time, but the scepter woke him up immediately. I could have actually put in some serious deeps if he wasn't Mez. Right, let's get our farm. Farm everything. Big farmers. I'm afraid. Get my bobble. Get the T2. Careful. She's getting jumped. I think she just got blinked upon. That's a nice route. Send it. Yes. Yes, he's here. Get the snake. Wait, is my soul gem heal going to hurt me? Doesn't look like it. This Oplosh is so annoying, man. <laughs> I hate him. I'm about to buy Wingblade Morgan the Fame. <laughs> I hate him so much. He just uses his things when I use my things, and then I get thinged on. Like, what the thing? Ow! Keep talking about their range, but I have like very similar range. I just need to play it a little better so that I hit them and they don't hit me. You know what I'm saying? You didn't get me? Dude, this bobble is actually gonna be sick though. Ooh, OG Williker. If I got that that uh fear, I would have ulted. Almost died. Oh, 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 <laughs> Having a great time getting slain. Oh, oh. You guys spit on me. What the heck? Dude, this bobble is going to be so good. I'm so ready. I'm so ready. Send it. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Bro, you got to hit that. Oh, wait. He did, kind of. The turn and burn? Ah! Oh, am I dead? I live. I live that, I live that, I live that. They don't have any ult. Oh, that's BZ just Medusa. BZ just me, too. Wait, stop taking that scepter, Koomba. You should know what it does to you. You cannot use its power to maximum efficiency. Alright. Get this. Alright, Medusa no blink. Not scared. Huge back. Absolutely huge. Alright, the build is coming together. We get Soul Reaver last, I think. 
What if I just want to tank Morgan this game, dude? I'm actually kind of feeling like, what if I just had like a defense item? What if I had mantle? Wait, I'm getting mantle. <laughs> I still need 10% more CDR. I'm tripping. I only have four. Wait, no, I have 50. All right, I'm double tripping. I'm tripping on my trips. Don't need mantle. Take it back. Put him in the air. Put him in the air. Can't really walk into this. But I'll try. Just for you. He can't finish him. Thank you. That was a troll, wasn't it? Oh, I was hoping that slow would be enough to secure my thingy. Hey! Hey! What do you mean you're F6ing? Bro, right as I was having fun too. Come on, man. What a boner killer, bro. What the heck? I just turned into a freaking floppy woppy after that. Dude, dude, dude. 53 for a 17 minute F6. Dude, my build is finally come. God, I'm raging. That build actually was going to be really good, though. I'm not even trolling. Turn it to a <laughs> Don't worry, Zion. Like, just think about it like this, dude. Like, like, I was straighter than a giraffe's neck. But then after that game, I was a literal caterpillar. Floppy woppy. All right, anyway. <clears throat> the rest of the build is going to be, uh, I think Soul Reaver was going to be my last item. Even though they only have one tank. Like, he's got a whole lot of health. And the Soul Reaver procs would be hitting him for over 100. So it would have been pretty gnarly. Let's check the damage numbers in a second. Right after we get over this. Um, I would have finished the starter into... Alternate timeline. This build would have been real juicy. You got 20%, 30%, 40%, 50%. CDR. 20% pen. And all I need is a little Soul Reaver action. Because they went double carry. Especially Obsidian Shard was a little bit less of a thing that I was super looking into. Um, if they had been a tank focused front line type of deal. I probably would have gone Charon's Coin. Chronos Pendant into Soul Reaver. And then if I was really feeling like they were still too tanky, we get Ob Shard next. But because I'm against double carry there, like two full damage carries, I ended up going Soul Gem Sphinx's Bobbles because we were just playing like a poke game, right? Where I'm just playing for max range and cooldown is the name of the game. Don't really need much pen at all to take down Medusa, Opwash, like Shard and Reaver, if I got those instead, are only doing so much. So I get to go with a very fun, fun haver, 50% CDR Sphinx's Bobbles build. And just try to abuse my CDs to just like try and three them from max range. And the only ability that I really need to worry about if I'm playing a game like that is uh, Opwash 1. And I kept getting hit by the darn thing. And it was very annoying. But we output 22k. 4.8k Kumba as Kumba does. And Neath is actually keeping pretty good pace with me there. I'm a little surprised that she was able to keep up that much damage. But if that game had gone on any longer, like dude, I was... I was chomping at the bit to beat them down. Let me tell you, would have been would have been beautiful. Had a whole ton of MP5 and a whole ton of CDR, so it would have been just casting and casting and casting and casting and casting until we got a clip worthy moment that would have just won the game. And that's all I wanted, man. But they 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 couldn't let me have it. They couldn't let me have it. Another option for that last item would have been um, Rod, Rod of Tootie. or a last item Book of Thought. Probably couldn't have been that bad. But probably Rod if I were to go the more damage route because like i said i'm just trying to hit these carries with poke it would be nice to have the reaver for atlas but it was a decision i still had to make and i was still going to get my alternate timeline like it was it was just all coming together for me like a perfect storm of events maybe they saw they were like knew that i was about to go hecking crazy and you know i can't blame them because that sphinx's bobble was pretty gnarly i had what seven second cooldown on my three and what were the other CDs? The ult's 45, right? 45 second ult. 7 second... Wait, this should have been lower. 6.5? I did have 50%, right? 20, 30, 40, 50. Yeah. Why did it say 7 when I was looking at it at the end of the game? Am I tripping? 
Well, it should have been six and a half second uh, three. So I only have 2.5 out of every 6.5 seconds. I'm not buffed with 24% uh, movement speed. Moving absolutely criminally fast. Six second two. God, Bobble just makes his character so sick, huh? 5.5 on the one, so I just comboing people every, what's that, like six and a half seconds. Feels good. Real fun build. You guys should try it out if you go against double carry teams like that. But definitely keep in mind the Soul Reaver Obshard thing in case you again go against uh, some really tanky targets like they slap you with like an Achilles Bacchus or something. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed that one. Learned a thing or two. Saw the, the fun of the bobble, even though they cut us off in the end right before we got to have the most funnest Everest. So leave a like on the video if you enjoyed and subscribe to the channel for more and I'll get you later.